Hello guys, welcome back to Lady G's TV. Why Moses Bliss left all Nigerian girls and married from Ghana? Wow, he made the revelation, guys. This is not easy. Oh, I heard it. I was so surprised. I said, make a bring and for Una so that Una too Una Yeramo. Yes, so. Rino Omokri, a controversial media figure, discusses why Moses Bliss, a well known Nigerian gospel musician, married a lady from Ghana rather than one from his home country. It should be noted that the pair married a few days ago in a lavish ceremony that drew Nigerian celebrities to the neighboring nation. Oh my god, Omo, would not take years to read for it by yourself, so. And he claims that Ghanaian women are more relatable than other Nigerian women. He also mentioned that in Ghana and other nations, women may love without demanding monetary payback from men. Furthermore, he stated that if Nigeria had visa-free or visa on arrival access, there would most certainly be an increase in unmarried women in Nigeria. This is because many Nigerian men travel inside Africa and upon seeing attractive women who are not primarily driven by money, may acquire a liking for them rather than Nigerian Nigerian women. Hey, this one past power. Oh. Nigerian women, is this true? Let me hear you in the comment section below. Why Moses Bliss married from Ghana and not Nigeria? I can understand why Moses Bliss married a Ghanaian. I have been to Ghana and their women tend to be easier to relate with than many other southern Nigerian women. In fact, is love without billing still possible in southern Nigeria? In our part of the world, he is loving, means he is spending. Oh, Mo, when you tell many southern Nigerian girls, I love you, they hear you owe me. Especially those with industrious money, obtain a culture. Hey, if Nigeria had visa-free or visa on arrival access to more countries, there would be an epidemic of unmarried women in Nigeria. Ha! Because when Nigerian, when Southern Nigerian men travel within Africa and outside Africa and encounter beautiful women who are not money conscious, they quickly lose their appetite for Nigerian women already. Nigerian men are considered a cash by South African and Kenyan and Kenyan women. Ha, this one loud too. We urgently need a cultural reorientation among our women, especially in southern Nigeria. The monetization of relationship in southern Nigeria is just too suffocating. I am well traveled. I am yet to see the level of commercialization of romance I have seen in southern Nigeria. I call it as I see it. Ha, Nigerian people, let me hear your point of view. This one past power. Is this really true? Ha, I doubt too. Or maybe it is true. I don't even know what I can say. Let me hear from you guys what you have to say. But at the end of the day, let God be our driver in everything that we do, especially when choosing a life partner. That is what I have to say. Thank you for watching and please don't go without subscribing. Cheese!